gentlemanly thing to do is for you to start. Okay, if you insist. As you know, ladies, making it in sport is one thing, but picking yourself up and fighting back to the top after hitting the bottom takes a special quality. Yes, falling art is the easy part, but getting back up not only takes dedication, but guts and courage. That's right. We admire all sporting champions, and there are a lot of them here tonight, because tonight is just like the Oscars, but for sports. For sports, but those with the character to make comebacks deserve particular recognition. And that's exactly what they're getting here this evening, as the Academy honors the best of those who came back in wonderful style in the last year. These are the five nominees shortlisted for the Laureus Award for the World Comeback of the Year. Yanitsa Kostelec, Croatia, Alpine Skiing. Yanitsa recovered from knee surgery to become the first Alpine skier to win four medals at the Winter Olympics. Hermann Meyer, Austria, Alpine Skiing. The Herminator returned after a motorcycle accident to take the Super G silver medal at the World Championships. Ronaldo, Brazil, football. Written off as finished with a knee injury, Ronaldo came roaring back to shoot Brazil to the 2002 World Cup. Pete Sampras, United States, tennis. Slammed by the critics, Pistol Pete proved them all wrong by defeating Andre Agassi in the US Open final. Franziska van Almsick, Germany, swimming, overcame years of poor form and a motorcycle crash to win five golds at the European Championships. To present the award, please welcome Academy member. He has gone higher in the world than any other athlete. Known for his large pole, Sergei Bukpa. Gosh, I am very fortunate this evening. Good evening. The competition for the Sportsman Award has just been unbelievable this year. This is the creme de la creme of sport. Someone is about to get the sporting equivalent of an Oscar. It is the most prized award men's sport because it is judged by an academy of experts who really know what they're talking about. Now let's cut to what is almost literally the chase. These are the five nominees shortlisted by the Academy for the Award Sportsman of the Year. Lance Armstrong, United States, cycling. Lance, the undisputed king of the road, recorded his fourth successive Tour de France victory. Ronaldo, Brazil, football. Ronaldo scored both goals in the final to bag the golden boot and help Brazil win their fifth World Cup. Ole Einar Bjørndalen, Norway, biathlon. Ole became the first biathlete to win four gold medals in a single Olympiad at Salt Lake City. Michael Schumacher, Germany, Formula One. Michael scorched to his fifth world title in emphatic style with a record-breaking 11 race wins. Tiger Woods, United States, golf. Tiger won the first two majors of 2002 and six titles in all as he continued to dominate the fairways. The Laureus, on behalf of the Academy, we have two distinguished members. From the United Kingdom, multi-Olympic gold medalist Tani Gray Thompson, the king of cycling Spaniard, Miguel Induria. We have...
Thank you very much for this award. It's such a wonderful achievement because it means a lot to me because it's not, you know, people in press that's actually voting this award. It's actually champions that actually have been there and know the hard work that's put forth every day out of the year and every moment and all the effort that's given. So this is really special to me. So thank you very much. And um, I'd like to thank my sister, too. For some reason, I was playing her at all the time in the finals of all those <laughs> slams, so that was tough, but <laughs> I don't know. But thank you very much. I really appreciate it. Thank you.